Hi friends, I am Arun Giri. You are most welcome to our channel Technical Concept. Our today's topic is regarding air compressor. So in this video, we are going to see how to calculate air compressor efficiency. So in detail, we are going to see the volumetric efficiency calculation of air compressor. So keep watching this video up to last. And if you have not subscribed my channel till now, then please subscribe the channel and also press the bell icon. So let's start our topic without wasting the time. So, in the first of all, we'll see which are the parameters required for volumetric efficiency calculation of air compressor. The first parameter that we required is volume of air receiver in cubic feet. Okay, the receiver in which we are storing uh, compressed air after compression in air compressor. That air receiver volume we need in cubic feet. Then, air compressor capacity in CFM. Okay, this parameter you will get on the name plate of air compressor. Okay, the means design capacity of air compressor in CFM. Okay, then load and unload pressure of air compressor that you have to see. Okay, and then time taken to load and unload. Okay, so this you, uh, you will get on uh, air compressor when air compressor is running. Okay, so now we'll see how to calculate it. So this is the formula for calculation of volumetric efficiency of air compressor means how you will uh, calculate actual CFM of air compressor using this formula ok so here V is uh, the formula is V into P into 60 divided by T here V is nothing but volume of the sewer in cubic feet then here P is nothing but pressure difference between load and unload pressure in atmosphere ok so here P is pressure difference between load and unload and then T is time taken in seconds to load and unload ok it's time between load and unload this time will be in seconds ok as CFM is the design capacity of uh, air compressor that you will get on the name plate of air compressor ok so now we will see how to calculate so data provided here I have taken one example the receiver volume I have taken 500 liters. Generally, receiver volumes are provided in liters. Okay, so you have to convert these liters into 7 uh, cubic feet. So I have converted this uh, liter into cubic feet. So it is 17.66 cubic feet. Load pressure is 6 kg in my compressor and unload pressure is 7 kg. That means on 6 kg our compressor is loaded and when it's, uh, its pressure is 7 kg, then its gets unloaded. So these are the load and unload pressures. Then difference between this load and unload is 7 minus 6 that is 1 kg per square centimeter. Okay. So we have to calculate uh, convert this difference pressure into atmospheric pressure. So 1 kg per square centimeter is equal to 0.968 atmosphere. So I have converted this kg in kg per square centimeter into atmosphere because in our calculation we need pressure in atmospheric pressure ok now time taken to unload is 12 seconds ok so unload to unload time is 12 seconds so now we put all these values in this formula ok so after calculation we are getting 85.47 CFM this is the actual calculated CFM of air compressor now we will see how to calculate volumetric efficiency so volumetric efficiency formula is Calculator CFM divided by design CFM into 100. So our calculator CFM is 85.47 that we have calculated in earlier slide here. Okay. And design CFM that is provided on the name plate of air compressor is this 96. So after calculation we are getting 89%. Okay. So our air compressor efficiency is 89%. So this is how we are calculating the volumetric efficiency of air compressor. Okay. So this is all about the today's video. I hope you like the video. If you like the video, then please press like button, subscribe the channel and also share the videos. So thanks for watching. Bye bye.